Yo, what is up YouTube? Thank you guys for tuning in. Before we get started with this video, I want to give a quick thank you and shout out to all the new subscribers that came over to my channel for the Crew Kicks collection video. And also all the old subscribers that have been watching my videos constantly. I really appreciate you guys. I'm on the road to hit 10k. And if you do enjoy this video, please share it with your friends. Let them know I'm close to 10k. Hopefully we can get that together. So before we go through with this video, my voice is a little messed up. It's a little gone. I'm barely getting it back. So hopefully you guys can bear with me and we get through this video together. This video here is actually going to be on the Unique Low Times Cost Collection that released earlier in April and we launched yesterday, May 20th, and also it's going to be launching on the 27th of this month. Uh, this collection here is actually a collection that I really like because Cause is an artist who, if you don't know, was a street artist, graffiti artist, whatever you want to title him, and he's actually been collaborating with a lot of big name brands like Supreme, Vans, Vape, and a lot of other brands. He's most, he's it. Some of his most popular stuff is the uh, Medicom toys that he makes, which are like little uh, bear brick type things that you can buy in a bunch of different sizes. They're also kind of overpriced in my opinion, but it is art, so you pay for what you get. Uh, but without further ado, let me show you guys a few of the collection pieces and I'll talk to you guys about them. Let's get into it. All right, so they actually sold out originally. The whole collection sold out originally when they released in April at all the unique, unique clothes stores in my area. I'm in LA, so I have a few different stores, and it's all sold out. When, once they sold out, Nico had already announced that they were going to relaunch it, basically restock it uh, at all their locations in late May. So what I'm guessing is they mass produce some more, and send them out to a bunch of different stores, and that's actually what really happened because I woke up yesterday morning, May 20th, trying to get them online, and it sold out. It said it was sold out, but I actually woke up before they even released, so I didn't end up getting them. I ended up heading to a few different Nico stores uh, afterwards in the afternoon, and they still had bunch of the shirts available so if you're watching this video Saturday or Sunday April 21st and 22nd you can probably still head over to your local unique clothes store and pick some of those up of course some of the more popular ones are going to be sold out I actually went to the Santa Monica location and the Beverly Center location and the Beverly Center location uh, the staff there told me that they had a lot of shirts like they sent them a lot and it did seem like it so if you're heading over there planning to head over there I would recommend giving them a call just to be sure that they have the one you're looking for and also they're in Japan sizing so if you wear a small sorry if you wear a medium you would have to size up and get a large because uh, they run small so uh, unfortunately the big size they go up to is an extra large Japan sizing which is a large US size uh, but hopefully they make some more in bigger sizes but for you guys who are interested in picking these up these are the ones that I actually was able to get so somehow I ended up getting more than what I needed I ended up Lucky now online. After they originally released, you can probably still find like a few different sizes scattered online. And I picked up two different shirts online that I haven't got yet, uh, but I did also find ones that I actually wanted in stores. And uh, luckily enough, this one here was one of my favorite ones. This is the this is simple pocket tee with X's on the on the pocket, all green, little design on the back. This is one of the two that I actually really wanted. Uh, this one here is the. Companion t-shirt, that's what these things are called, the companions. This one's really simple as well. Design on the front, nothing on the back. But my favorite out of the whole collection had to be this shirt here. It came in black and white, I actually really like both of them. It's a simple uh, heart on the pocket logo. On the pocket t-shirt, it's a little heart with the X's on them. That's what he's uh, popular for, the little X's on the eyes and the little characters like similar to this. And I really like this one because it's a plain white tee with a little design on it and I can actually see myself wearing this a lot throughout the whole summer and spring so these three are three different ones that I actually picked up these two here are my favorite with the, uh, with the white pocket CD being my favorite out of all of them the reason why I actually like these so much is because Cause is an artist who usually does limited drops I meaning he'll uh, him and a company will collab and they'll make limited releases of stuff and on this collab with Uniqlo they're actually at a store uh, that's been popping up a lot in my local area in Los Angeles and the store here is not, in my opinion, they're not that popular among sneakerheads and uh, sneaker enthusiasts. The collection here was actually really cool because they had sold out originally. So uh, at first I thought they were going to be fairly limited. Everybody thought they were going to be fairly limited. But what they're doing is they're producing them for the masses. So they're making a lot and they're going to keep restocking them until everybody who actually wants them can actually get them. Unlike a bunch of other stores who make stuff, they sell out and people, resellers, go up, go up and raise the price on everybody. These collections are actually really affordable. Each shirt was about 14 something, so with like about 15, 16 dollars after taxes. And of course, 
uh, like I said, they're producing a lot of them, so don't pay resale. If you really want a shirt, call around, wait. There's actually a few dropping on the 27th of May, which is next weekend. And um, I'll leave a few pictures on the screen so you guys can see which ones are dropping. If you are interested in those, again, just call your local store because a lot of stores are going to be getting a lot of them. So make sure you guys stay in contact with them. And also call your local stores if you're interested in any of these. So this one here, they actually had it at the Beverly Center. This one here, they had it. Uh, they did not have it at the Santa Monica location, but um, at the Beverly Center, they had a lot. So if you're interested in this one, go ahead and hit them up and try to get this one for you guys. These two here are actually uh, available at both locations, and I was able to get these at the Santa Monica store. All right, so like I said, I ended up going to Santa Monica yesterday, and I was able to pick up those shirts. Uh, I did make a little vlog type video. It's actually on my Instagram account. I'm not going to be uploading it here because it is fairly short. So here goes a short clip. If you're interested in watching the full clip, make sure you guys follow me on my Instagram account. I'll leave a little bubble somewhere around here. But that's actually going to do it for this video. Hopefully this video helped you guys out. If you did enjoy it, please give it a big thumbs up. Again, I'm sorry for my voice. And until next time, peace.